Hi all, I'm Jessica from The Hood School of Acting and today we're going to talk about the importance of relationships in acting. So I'm going to have two of my advanced students demonstrate a relationship in the Meisner technique. The focus is for them to have the behavior of the relationship with ever, without ever talking about it at all. We out here should be able to tell who they are to each other. Are they neighbors? Um, are they best friends? Are they siblings? Are they lovers? By their behavior. And then this is going to go even beyond that. So when we talk about relationships, there's different stages to them. There's going to be simple relationships, which is lovers, boss, employee, siblings, things like that. Just simple, just to have the behavior of what it's like to be around your sibling as opposed to your boss. And then we're gonna add some, some layers to it. Um, these guys today are gonna go as high as you can in the layers, they're raising the bar and the stakes here. We've set up a very intense relationship. Um, ideally, you out here should be able to tell their location, who they are to each other, and what's going on without them talking about it at all. So I'm gonna go ahead and give them a call in and they're gonna demonstrate the relationship and then I'll pop back on and we'll chat about it. Okay, thanks. Feel guilty. Sorry. I feel ashamed. You feel ashamed. I'm, I'm so, I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry. I feel terrible. I don't know what to say. I appreciate that. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't know what to say. I feel bad for you. I feel really bad for you. I feel terrible for you. That's sincere, I appreciate it. I feel so much regret. 
feel regret? I feel a lot of regret. I understand. I'm sorry for what you've been through. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. So this is the relationship. Uh, before I talk about the relationship, I want to talk about how awesome that was and how touching and moving it was. Um, you know, that's not easy. And I think we all know that, but these two went so deep emotionally and they really allowed themselves to feel so much depth under these imaginary circumstances. This isn't happening to them, but gosh, when you watch it, you believe it is, right? Um, that's what we're working towards. And, and this takes a lot of work, years of classes to be able to achieve something like this. This was an improvisation uh, built around actually a true story that Diana read. We're doing Chicken Soup of the Soul, uh, the process of Spoon Rivers, and one of the, the stories is based off of a, a woman. Um, her grandpa was brutally murdered and um, almost eaten, I believe, uh, by this gentleman. So in the story, it's a gentleman, and her whole family won't forgive him and wants nothing to do with him, but Diana's character wants to forgive him. And it's took her a long time, taken her a long time to want to forgive him, but she, before her grandpa passed, she told him that she wanted to forgive him. Um, I mean, not before her grandpa, before her, her father passed, uh, she told him that she wanted to forgive him. So this is something that they decided, I wanna to try to do a relationship based around. So it's kind of like a loosely improvisation based around a scripted scenario. Um, the goal is for them to not talk about it at all, which they didn't. She didn't talk about her grandpa. She didn't talk about, he didn't talk about being in prison, but we get the idea um, by their behavior that they're not real close. They're not really comfortable. You also get the idea that he so badly wants her to forgive him and, and she's there hoping that he has he has remorse and he does and so because he does what happens to her she changes in such a beautiful way and what happens to him he changes that's the goal we come in with a strong point of view and we have a strong belief of the circumstances and we really listen to our partners and we allow these the other people to change us in a deep way they were able to achieve this extremely deep circumstance and and they achieved it in such a great fullness um, i'm so proud of them both uh, it was beautiful to watch and this is something that ideally you all will be able to work towards. Um, thanks for watching. And if you'd like to join a free online class, please click the link below. Thanks.